My name is Corey Martinez and I am a professional BMX rider. I'm bringing my friends on this trip to go film and ride motorcycles, go camping, and just enjoy the open air. My name is Corey Martinez. I was born in Texas. Parents traveled a lot when I was younger. Ended up moving to Alabama with them, and then grew up there. And then I moved to Nashville about three years ago. The Nashville scene is really strong. And moving here allowed me to ride with new people. All the locals here are ripping, definitely. I, I enjoy every time I come out here. I always have someone fun to ride with. When I'm at home and I'm not traveling, I, I pretty much just enjoy hanging out with Rochelle. Whether we come out into the backyard and play with the dogs, you know, throw the ball and sticks with them, uh, it's just something that we love to do. It's like our dogs are pretty much like our kids, really. Uh, with owning a house, there's a lot of maintenance that needs to be done, so I try and take care of stuff around the house. I was in the second grade when my dad came home with that bike, and that's pretty much how it got started and when I got started. From there, it just kind of grew. I was riding with all the local neighborhood kids, just riding all the ditches and curb cuts in the neighborhood. This one girl that was a sister to a friend that I would always ride with said, you should meet my friend, you know? Like, he rides also, and he lived about 20 minutes away, and uh, that friend just happened to be Seth Kimbrough. From that moment on, basically started going to his house every weekend. We hit it off right away. We were at the roller skating rink. That was kind of the thing we did um, every Friday night. He was 11, I was 12, you know, we were young kids. He was at my house every weekend. We were sneaking out to ride our bikes in the middle of the night and, and all that. So that just became the number one passion and all we could think about. Seth loves riding. He loves to push himself and be creative and he looks good riding. For myself, contests do not give me enough time to ride the way I want to ride. I'm not that perfect rider. You know, I can't do everything first go. I wish I could sometimes because it's really frustrating trying something time after time for a couple hours. That's why I enjoy filming and try and put more work into filming a video part. You don't feel pressured into being perfect. You can mess up and keep trying again over and over. If I'm trying a trick for an hour and a half, two hours, and you pull that trick, there's nothing more gratifying than sitting there and like feeling you accomplished this. My favorite video part that definitely influenced me as far as street riding goes is going to be the same as everyone else's, Van Holman, Criminal Mischief. I'd never seen anything like that before. We had no idea that Criminal Mischief would, you know, have the impact that it has. You know, it was a crew of dudes that were having a good time going on road trips together. Video parts like that, when they came out, they stuck around a long time. That's what people talked about for two, three years, and people are still talking about that video part. <laughs> My first video part was Square One, Wide Awake Nightmare. For me, Square One video part was definitely something that helped me see riding in a different way. And that was also due to the friends I was hanging out with at the time. Brian Wismerski, Van Holman, and Bob Sherbo. Those guys were a huge influence on me. Every day it was like the Corey demo. You know, what's, what crazy thing is Corey going to do today that we've never seen before? Um, it was a lot of fun just traveling around with him and, and just watch the progression, you know, but it was in such an organic way. It wasn't forced or in a competitive way at all. It was just Corey pushing himself and helping us push ourselves. They traveled all the time and I just tagged along and they had cameras already. I didn't know anything about this. I'm just riding my bike at the time. Those guys took me under their wing for sure with helping me out, showing me the direction of like a different side of riding besides contest. My personal favorite video part that I filmed and that I feel like kind of made me who I am as a rider would be the Federal Trafilio video. That was when I first started traveling outside of the US. I went to England, to Germany, a couple different places to film for this video. And that opened up a whole new range of riding for me. Interest in motorcycles for me basically started when I was around 14, 15 years old. 
My dad always rode motorcycles. He used to ride me around when I was a little kid, and I enjoy the open air feel. You know, the freedom that you get on a motorcycle. For this trip, what makes this exciting for me is pretty much, yeah, I'm bringing all aspects of the things I'm into together in one trip. I'm bringing my friends on this trip to go film and ride motorcycles, go camping, and just enjoy the open air. Going out to California right now, I'm really looking forward to hanging out with the guys out there that don't get to see a whole lot. The beautiful weather, Southern California weather, it's gonna be fun. Corey's like the seasoned veteran when it comes to motorcycles and BMX and life. Motorcycle trip sounds sick as fuck. I'm definitely down, 100% down. Oh, 